Hey, you guys, it's Jade. We are out at South by Southwest. We are joined now by AC Newman of New Pornographers. Uh, Awesome show last night. No, oh, thanks. At the main or Emos or Enos or, or Enos. whatever yeah. Spoon has renamed it. I, I I know I go by like I played at that place so long ago. Like my my first band opened for John Spencer Blues Explosion at some point in the nineties. Yeah. Um and I remember we played there in like two thousand and three and that was exciting. So it was it was cool to be back there. Yeah, it's such a weird venue too. Uh if you've never been, it's like there's just this facade of a door, and you walk through, and it's kind of like just an open alleyway, and then they put a stage up. Mm -hmm. It's the most ridiculous venue ever. But I don't know if it's still... It used to be half open. It used to be like in front of the stage was a covered area, but yeah. then beside it just seemed to be like an open courtyard yeah. where if it was raining, you would get wet. And I think there might have been a tree. Yeah, there, well, there, there wasn't a tree, but there was grass. Oh, okay. Yeah. It was. It's very. It's a very strange venue, but like only in Austin is that possible that there's some weird alleyway that they were just like, let's put a door on it and you can open a bar. Yeah, it's uh, a. <laughs> it's very. It's very classic. Yeah. Well, whiteout conditions. We've been enjoying it a lot on the current, and uh, you know, down at South by Southwest, listening to you perform these, this music, uh, a lot of people are out here and kind of disparage a South by Southwest every now and then because mm -hmm. it's changed so much over the years. Mm -hmm. uh, is there, what is it that you c keep coming back for? You know, what, what is it that makes South by Southwest South Well, Southwest? I mean, it's nice that we can come back here and play good shows. Yeah. Like, it's not, you know, it can be depressing if you come here and you're just playing 10 showcases and there's like 15 people at them because there's like 200 showcases going on simultaneously. So... And, and yesterday was amazing, you know, because we know those Spoon guys and they asked us to play. And you, and you don't see them except when you're playing with them. So, And then a lot of label people. Just, you know, it's like just people you don't see, like Mac. You know, Mac who runs Merge Records and from Super Chunk. You see him and, you know, like people from Matador that I never see or Beggars. It was, uh, you know, Jason Narducci who plays with, like, Bob Mole. Just cool people that I saw Jason Faulkner there. It was very cool. Yeah. There's been a, a lot of, I think that's what it is. It's this community, even just being here uh, yesterday, there would just be, you know, somebody come back and you're like, oh, wow, is that Matthew from Not A Surf? Is this, you know, yeah. like everybody's just walking I around. Mean, I mean, if you're walking down 6th Avenue in the middle of the day, you think, this sucks, I hate this. But then when you're, you know, when you're in a, when you're in a club like that and you see all these, music, you see bands play, and I saw a, a giant dog play who were amazing, so and, I ne and I'd never seen them. So, you know, you're surrounded by, you know, old friends and you see an amazing band you've never seen before and it's, you know it's, uh, that part of it's cool um but you know it's sort of a a rarefied experience i don't know it's not it's not everybody's experience of it so i feel very uh grateful yeah well i was grateful to c catch the show last night mm -hmm. uh, well we've been uh so we drove down from minnesota mm -hmm. wrote down uh some questions when we were slightly loopy in the car so we've got some uh, sort of like pick your poison. Are they like generic questions? Uh, sort of. And you just put them in my hand. We can grab a couple of them. Okay. Yeah, let's do there you three. Go. There's two. All right. And three. All right, let's see what we got here. Okay, so what's a song you have listened to recently like 10 times in a row? What's been on replay for you? Um, the first one that pops in my mind is. Uh, how does it make you feel? By Once in Future Band, they're um, they're on Castle Face Records and they're from Oakland, I believe, and they're this really cool pop band with this insane sort of like this sort of sound like Yes and ELO and Steely Dan, just this crazy kind of like prog '70s pop thing, um, which is just so up my alley. Like it's one of those. You'd hear a song and a minute into it, you're like, oh, I love this. Yeah. It's like, I'm buying this record, <laughs> even though I've only heard the first minute of it. That's kind of, that's how you can tell it's a good song. If immediately after it ends, you're like, you know what, I could just do that all over again. And it's six or seven minutes long, and it's still, uh, it's, it's got still, that it's still, epic it's still got that thing. Yeah, it's yeah. just like, it stretches through these different waves and movements. Um, that's awesome. That that's that's a song that jumps into my mind. I'm sure there are others, but no, whatever comes first. That's what we want to know. Yeah. All right. Let's see. What is a word that describes your current mental state? God, I don't know. It's a tough one. 
<laughs> it probably changed. A low, uh, a low level, a low level comfortable anxiety, I suppose. Just that sort of white noise. A, a sort of, a back. sort of, a sort of functioning anxiety. Yeah. I think I think that's where a lot of people are at right now. Mm -hmm. And uh, all right, what's the? Are you somebody who you remember your dreams? Uh, no. Occasionally. All right. Do you do you, what's a what's a dream that you remember lately or the weirdest? Actually, God, I wish I could remember. I can't remember. It's like I can almost remember, but I can't quite. I feel like that's a lot of times with dreams. You wake up with like a feeling, but there's just this vague recollection of something. Something happened in some sort of feeling. Mm hmm Yeah. I remember it was like a. I have these dreams that are just not quite nightmares. Like they're not. It's just sort of unpleasant. You're in. You're in a place, and it's like. This is not that good. I don't really like it here. But it's not like I'm waking up going, <gasps> just gasping. Screaming. Yeah. It's cold sweats. Yeah. Uh, and yet more like, thank God, I don't live in that <laughs> lousy place. Yeah. Well, we're glad that you're here too. Mm -hmm. We are live at South by Southwest with AC Newman of New Pornographers. And uh, one last question: We're kind of asking everybody. Uh, you know, Minnesotans, and uh, we love our prince, and we're coming back on the year of his passing and we're just kind of collecting people's memories or feelings or perhaps like a song uh, do you do you have any you know um, my main memory of Prince is I never got to see him live except once um, we got tickets to an SNL taping where he was the musical guest and it was Steve Martin and it was a terrible episode but we had seats that were like right in front of the stage, like in the balcony, but when we looked straight ahead, it was Prince, and it was just really surreal. Like, we saw, we saw Prince play two songs, and I felt like the whole time I was sort of in a daze. I was, like, I was just thinking, what the F? I'm watching Prince. <laughs> and then he, he, like, left, you know, and left just, like, walked underneath us. <laughs> and I remember thinking, like, well, that's cool. I got to see Prince. Yeah. Yeah, he does have that kind of <laughs> and, 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 like, And huh. it was good for my, my level of uh, attention, you know, like... <laughs> Two songs, and I'm out. Yeah. Well, AC Newman, thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, the new album, White Out Conditions, we've been enjoying it a lot on The Current. And like I said, caught the show last night. If you get a chance, go see oh. some new pornographers. Thank you. Uh, this is Jade, and we are live at South by Southwest. Thanks for watching.